is this uh, Thursday the 15th of August just coming out to 8 o'clock and um, as you see the sun's setting on the pond at the moment uh, just doing a quick overnighter and uh, gotta be off quite early in the morning so I gotta go to work uh, unfortunately the session didn't start off very well <coughs> um, we had news today that there was two dead fish here so we had a mirror and a common and uh, the common was hopper which I've had in a previous video over on the other lake which is the boating lake not sure how it's got here but it was got here and unfortunately it's uh, been found belly up um, so yeah I'll put a bit of video of when I caught it in here now so you can have a quick look at it and what the fish was and uh, it's just a shame to see it go really and also put some pictures on as well we gave it a little bit of a burial it's gone off buried them together at the top yeah. Mitch has had a good walk around the lake today as well uh, while well, I've been setting up and He's pretty sure he could smell another dead one right at the top up there, so we might find another one in a few days' time if the wind changes and pushes it out. Uh, but he said it doesn't smell good at all. So if it is free, it's bad news to the pond. Tell you, it's not very good. Don't know what's causing it, to be honest. But uh, the mirror, uh, it was a bit smaller than the common, but uh, the mirror had obviously been dead a bit longer. And it absolutely stunk. It was bad, real bad. Uh, maggots was coming out of his mouth so it's obviously been there a little while and uh, the common was just down here when I when I come down this evening um, been moved out from underneath the tree it's been there for a few days apparently whether it's the change in water it didn't like or there's something in the water which is killing them off it's not good I'm just hoping fingers crossed we don't find any more because there's not many in here as it is anyway I gotta get two more rods out yet, so uh, I'm gonna sign off for now, and uh, most probably gonna check in in the morning, but hopefully throughout the night. morning so it's 25 past five got the kettle on the ducks are awake and kind of awake the lake is starting to wake itself up and um, unfortunately no fish last night I had quite a few bleeps on the uh, right hand rod um, and a couple of shows um, boshes over the top on the spot I was very confident after I seen those I thought I'm gonna have one but it's not materialized yet uh, but the other two rods, the middle and the left, they've uh, remained motionless. So, um, yeah, it's just going to be a, like I said, I have a brew now, have something to eat. That should take me up to about six o'clock and then I've got to start packing up pretty quickly. And then I've got to be, uh, I've got to be leaving at seven to get to work. So, never mind. This might be the last time you see me on this session. It was only a quickie. And, uh, Oh, bit of... I was watching something on the surface over there. Looks like there's some blow coming up over there by the stumps. Um, but yeah, so um, it might be the last time you see me on this session. Uh, we'll be getting out hopefully again and doing another one soon. I think my cue is to go now. Kettle's done. So uh, again, thanks for watching. And um, obviously hit the like button, subscribe, all that sort of stuff. And, Thanks to all my new new subscribers recently as well, and obviously for the existing ones for staying loyal, and uh, see you next time.